Hi, welcome to Fun With My Podge. My name is Anna and this is Suzanne and we're going to teach you how to create this fun silk screen print using my Podge, an old pair of hand, pantyhose, and um, an embroidery hoop. One good thing about this project is if you get a run and you're really good pantyhose, you don't have to throw them out. You can now make some silk screens with it. So you're going to take an embroidery hoop and you'll take the inside part and, and you're going to slide it through. over. One good hit, hit, uh, tip is to sand the embroidery hoop because sometimes they you don't want to hit a snag. Get that little guy on top. And, and then just tighten it just a little bit Okay. so it won't go anywhere. Okay. Now you're going to flip it over flip it and over. I would go ahead and pull it a little bit to tighten it. You want it nice that. and firm on the, you know, the pantyhose so it's not all wobbly. Okay. Just cut off the uh -huh. edge. And then you can use the Mod Podge silicone mat is excellent for this method. You can use wax paper. It works just as well. I've already tried it to make sure. Yeah, we test everything here at Fun Mod Podge. Yes, you we don't do. have to. <laughs> so that way I, I go ahead and make all the mistakes for you because I have Mod Podge at my disposal. It's Hallelujah. really fun. Yeah, it's fun. Though. Now we got yeah, You can make another one with that, See? but we're gonna put that in our little stash we'll, over here. We'll stash that We'll stash later. that for later. You're gonna put your downloadable art, which we have it right there. You're gonna be able to download this from the instructions that are mm -hmm. gonna be at Plaid Online. And so the reason I did, I love slime, is because I love slime, but also because there's so many kids that are making slime, and I made this little apron. That's so adorable. But you could also do it, you could do the t-shirt. So so what you're gonna do is you're gonna put the hoop on the silicone Face mat down. and you're gonna take this in place, just in two places. And this okay. is so it doesn't slide on you. Right and there. then we need to get us some Mod Podge. Mod Podge! We told you we had a lot. These are also available in gallons. What makes this really great is this is the gloss and it's a sealer. So what we're going to do is gonna seal into the pantyhose. Yeah. So you're going to paint and leave the heart open. So what we're doing is we're making this a two-part silk screen. This is, this is really masking off the area that we don't want to paint, right? Right, it's sealing it? Yes. Yes, so you can really glob it on there too. And then you're gonna go all the way around the heart. Super easy. Um, let me see if I can put this down here. So you can see like where I was blocking out the black so that the slime could show in the background. And the reason you're gonna do it on the silicone mat is this way you can leave it to dry on the mat. Don't pull and it, it off. it won't get sticky. It, it'll peel right off after yeah. it dries. And the good thing about it is you don't have to draw your image on there first. Right. You can get a little bit more detail. You can do letters. You can do, you could do, this would be a great um, uh, silk screen to do um, maybe like a camp t-shirt or, yeah. or a um, family reunion or a monogram or even for like fraternities and sororities right you could do all kinds project, of that like all kinds of stuff so you just want to make sure it's really coated really well you want every little hole of the pantyhose filled in that's why you kind of put it on there kind of thick through the magic of film we've got one done <gasps> yay so we could slide let's slide that to the side okay. now we've let this dry completely okay. my punch is goes on white and then when it's dry, it's clear. clear. So you can see the difference. Let's look at the two right here. So when it looks like this, you just peel it off mm -hmm. the silicone. If you do it on wax paper, just peel it off the wax paper. And again, we've done two different versions. So now what we've got, we've got the big one, which is the overall print. And then the little heart is our second color. That's so cute. And you could layer all kinds of different colors. Over. Yeah. So we're gonna show you now how to do the silk screen. We're gonna do the big one. Alrighty. So put it in place. Just get a couple pieces of tape just so it doesn't move on you. Okay. Okay. And then the color, let's see if we're gonna let's do see, blue. Gonna blue, right? Yeah. Okay. And the to paint that we use, this is folk art multi-surface. Right here. And multi-surface meaning you can use it on fabric, you can use it on wood, metal. Any surface. Any surface. And you might have to add a little bit more. But is that yep. enough? No, you might add a little, little bit more. more. Yeah. More. Because you're just gonna you're gonna squeegee off what you don't need. Okay, there you go. That's okay. Good. All right. All right. So, so now you're going to use the Mod Podge squeezy, uh -huh, squeegee, and drag just drag it, it over. Drag it into those empty areas mm -hmm, that are not in covered. In the empty areas. And then where the Mod Podge is sealed right around the edge, you just want your extra paint to end up there. And it's, gonna, and it's a great reveal. This is one of those things, too. You could ombre. You could do two different Ooh, colors. Ooh, that would be fun. I'm so excited okay, for so the now reveal. now you're pretty... That's, I think that it's pretty good, good right? That's pretty coated. That's mm -hmm. pretty good. Okay, so... Now you can just sit your little thing over and okay. then you're going to Watch remove out. your piece of tape and then you're going to, and I'll hold your shirt down Okay. as you pull it off. Okay. Mm -hmm. 
Ready? Mm -hmm. One, two, three. Ooh, look at that. There you Can go. You see it? There's your silk screen. Woo! So now we're gonna let that dry. Then the second color is the heart that once this is completely mm -hmm. dry, you'll lay that down and then do the green. Yeah, and then you'll have this. Voila! The other thing that's really cool about this is now you just take this to the sink and run it through the sink. Just water, mm -hmm. I just did cold water, but the Mod Podge will stay. So that's some awesome. other, you know, glues, you can test, but some of them will come off of water. And I've done this now. This is the, I think the fourth uh, print I've made with this one. Remember, you can get the instructions online from Plaid Online, where you can get downloadable, uh, yeah, downloadable art. So if you guys like the video that we just did and you would love to see more, because we love having fun with Mod Podge, subscribe below. below. Thanks for watching Fun with Mod Podge. If you <laughs> Are you ready? <laughs> Sorry. If you like what we're making and want to see more, subscribe below. And what do I say? <laughs> what are you stressing about? Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. I'm cool now. I'm fine. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching Fun with Mod Podge. What am I supposed to say? Terrible of an actress. Because <laughs> they'd be like, oh god, we gotta go again.